There is a city where extreme white parties like to gather and to where the Russia-led International Investment Bank has recently moved its headquarters. This city is Budapest. Marine Le Pen, Eric Zemmour, Vox Party leaders and others have often taken pilgrimages there. In March 2021, Viktor Orban called for the creation of a new European right-wing force for his type of people, those who he says wants to protect their families and homelands. There is a country where Zelensky is portrayed as an enemy, where doubts are publicly voiced about Russian responsibility in the invasion of Ukraine, and where Ukraine's suffering does not evoke that much empathy. This country is Hungary. And there is a government who does not protect European and NATO information from Russian spying. Indeed, Hungarian diplomacy has practically become an open book for Moscow through the hacking of the Fidesz Ministry of Foreign Affairs network. Network hacking, which the government had direct knowledge of, but failed to alert their European counterparts. Budapest could become the entry point for Russian disinformation, Russian money, and the connecting thread between extreme right organizations.